You already know we got some juice in the item shop tonight. We got the Yule Trooper skin with the Backblink Sinister stocking. Now, this skin actually looks really cool. It's actually a hint about the Nightmare Before Christmas, if you've ever seen that movie with uh, Jack Skellington. This is pretty much on par with like the hat and everything. And the backlink itself is really nice as well. It's really, really cool. We also got this harvesting tool called the Branch Basher, which I don't know, this kind of feels like they're attempted another like candy ax kind of sorta with all the lights on it and everything. And I think it looks really cool. 1200 for this might be a stretch. You can't just put it's part of the Skull Squad and expect it to sell. I mean, I they could do that, but I don't know. We'll have to see how this looks in game because 1200 for this is a bit steep. And we also got a new rap called the Ho Ho Ho, which I'm going to tell you right now, it's kind of a Ho 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 scam. If you have one of these two raps, I'll show you really quick. Okay, so here's what I was talking about here. So here's the Ho 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 rap, right? And at first glance, it kind of reminded me of the Red Camo rap, which, you know, that's kind of fair. It does look like that. But then actually someone on Twitter actually sent me this. Look how similar this looks compared to this that is really really close here i'll even show you on like the scar it i don't know man here's the new wrap here's the old one that looks a little too similar to me even, even has like the spots on it and everything i don't know how i feel about that but regardless i think the wrap still looks nice maybe just a little bit unoriginal and also if you'd like to support pizzo make sure you use code pizzo p-i-z-0 pizzo with a zero now Let's get sweaty. All right, so here's first impressions of the skin and everything, and uh, it's pretty cool. The skin itself is great. I don't know. Do you think this could have been an edit style? I don't know. I think maybe it could have, but because it's Skull Trooper and Fortnite knows that Skull Trooper sells, I don't know. And plus the back bling's awesome. That is so cool. And this harvesting tool is huge, by the way. I was not expecting it. I was not expecting this harvesting tool to be so big. And uh, yeah, it's a little glitchy on creative. If you use your glider, it actually doesn't uh, doesn't work out the way it's supposed to. So that's kind of weird. But uh, yeah, so let's test out the uh, the wrap here. It's called Ho Ho Ho. It's nice. Maybe just a little too similar to the two other wraps I talked about. ADS is fine. Looks good on the RPG as well. And then on the sniper. One more time. Looks great. And then on the scar. It looks nice. It does look nice, honestly. I think Candy Cane's still a little bit better, though. And then this harvesting tool. My god. This thing is huge. Alright. So now we're going to do a test on it to uh, see what it sounds like. I love how, like, there's stuff coming off of it. Because if you guys, you know, if you celebrate Christmas and you get real trees, they shed a lot of the, um, of everything. Like, with the tree, it sheds a lot. So, uh, let's see what it sounds like when you're hitting opponents with shield. And then without. Alright, alright. So, we'll do it again. Hitting with shield. And without. All right, so I think it sounds pretty good. You can hear, like, all the lights. Like, you, you can kind of hear it. Okay. It's really interesting sounding. Is this worth 1200 oh, I don't know. I feel like both... I feel like both of these might be a tad bit overpriced. But again, it's Skull Trooper we're talking about. People are going to want to buy anything related to Skull Trooper, so... Yeah. Impact slash swing sounds pretty good, so uh, I do like that. Uh, let's try to do some sweaty 90s. Wow, I actually did pretty good. Not gonna lie. I did better than I thought I was gonna do, so... That's pretty cool. The Branch Basher. Does it match the given rarity? Oh my god, I feel bad for saying this, but I don't think it does. Me, personally, this is a little bit overpriced. It looks cool, sounds cool, I love what they did with it, but I think 1200 for this was a tad bit steep, so I'm going to give this a 1. And you can't even see it because my color is black and I'm on black, so let's try that again. 
Uh, one, and I'm now I'm not even on it. Okay, let's try that one more time. Uh, one out of two there. Do we like the color scheme? It's a Christmas tree with Christmas lights. Yeah, I'll take it. It's a two. Uh, do we like the equip sound? Actually, yes, I do. I like it a lot, actually. Do we like the impact slash swing? Yeah, I, I do as well. And do I see myself using it? Yeah, I'll give it a one. So we'll give this an eight out of ten for the Branch Basher. Again, it's a great harvesting tool, but it might be a little bit overpriced, in my opinion. And then we have the Ho 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 wrap, which honestly... Oh, we have two wraps that almost look identical to this, and Candy Cane I still think is a lot better. I don't know what they were thinking with this one. I mean, I wish they would have put, like, some bones in it or something like that to make it look like, you know, hey, it's part of the Skull Squad, because if you didn't say this, I would have no idea that this was for uh, the Christmas Skull Trooper at all. So I'll give it, like, a 9 out of 10. I mean, it looks nice. It's very affordable, but still, it's very unoriginal, at least to me. And with that being said, like in the video is always appreciated. Subscribing is free, and we will be back with a more in-depth review of the Yule Trooper. So hopefully you guys stick around for that, and we'll see you nerds on the live stream. See ya!